Hey there, Gemini, and welcome now to Monday. Well, overcast for the Geminis, but I argue you're feeling pretty strong today. The moon is in Capricorn, keeping your emotions kind of under the sheets, so to speak. It's our private self. It's where we have boundaries and where we put up our borders, and that does include intimacy, but it also includes things like truth and not truth, etc. So you're emotionally sensitive to those boundaries today. But the real focus, I think, still is long-term relationships. Now, I know last week all I did was talk about Pluto leaving Sagittarius. And what it came down to for Geminis was a simple choice. Are you going to continue on the current relations strategy and path, or are you going to try a new way of relating to yourself and others? Now that you've made that choice, it's time to experiment with that choice and really pick up the ball and start running. Now, chapter two of any transit is about experimentation. So for those of you in a relationship, this is an excellent time to try things differently. Try dating differently, try your routines differently, try your weekend regimens, try things different that will help and foster better relations. Also try relating to yourself differently. If you usually uh, you know, hit your thumb with the hammer and then scream at yourself and get mad at yourself, how's that working for you? Maybe you shouldn't relate to yourself that way. That does have repercussions down the line all the way into every relationship you have. So this is a great time to experiment. Now in that context, there's a lot of work that's starting to be done now on intimacy and where those boundaries are. Like I said, the moon is in this space, so emotionally you might be feeling a little vulnerable, at least a little private and sacred is a good way to put it. And Pluto's just entered this space, so now as of today, we begin a 16-year transit on how to be intimate and how to be close to others in a new way. That said, you actually have a lot of good fortune going on for the next 10 days. Venus, the planet of creativity, and Jupiter, the planet that gives us fortune and expansion and wisdom, they've come together and they're showing real creative breakthrough when it comes to intimacy. So if you've been having a hard time opening up to someone, there's a real great potential for a breakthrough in the next 10 days. Or if you've been having a hard time opening up to yourself, maybe due to some old uh, damage or wounds in your spiritual life, there's a real chance for breakthrough there in the next 10 days. So go for it, Gemini. You have nothing to lose with Jupiter there. All right, that's all I have for Monday. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. So